99.9 KEZ, Beth and Friends and Food, and look who's here, it's Jan Diatri. Hey, Beth. Hi. You look lovely today. Well, so do you. Are those real pearls? They're, they well, are. They're, they're giant they're mine. oyster. <laughs> they are the huge. Man, I know. That must I'm, have hurt. <laughs> <laughs> this is the necklace that walks in before you do. Holy cow, I like that. <laughs> um, this is the day where we turn you, Beth McDonald, yes. into a true paisano. See? See, yes, exactly. <laughs> you are going to be McDonaldino. Okay. And I promise on St. Patty's Day, I will Will be an odiatri. Okay. But anyway, we a couple of weeks ago we talked about Rayos, the mm -hmm. the, the pasta sauce yes. that you buy in store. Spelled if, R A O. Right, and if you go to the store now, you'll see all the pasta sauces, and then there's an empty void where Rayos is because it's gone. People love it. My mama mm -hmm. got wind of it, and she said, "No, no, no, we're going to teach a bath how to make a mama's meat sauce." Okay. So this is the only meat sauce you will ever need. You're tasting it. Wow, Do you like it's it? It's delicious. Isn't yes. It? So it's smooth, right? It yes. doesn't have that acidy right. bitter. Okay, Correct. so let's what you're looking at right here is a complete pot of sauce. So what you have here is the complete pot of meat sauce, bolognese sauce. And here are my secrets, Beth. First of all, it's got that miracle blend of sweet yellow onion, carrot and celery and garlic. Carrot okay. makes a big difference. Now if you notice here, I've chopped it diced it very, very fine. Right. Now you don't want big chunks of anything in there. Then it's got a pound of uh, beef mm. and a half a pound of Italian sausage. That's Hot important. Italian sausage. It is. The okay. combination of pork and beef. Mm. Now you're going to use organic crushed tomatoes. Generally, I would say throw in a can of tomato sauce. Mm -hmm. The organic somehow makes a big difference. Okay. If you're going to use mushrooms. So like near Glen or something like that. Exactly. Okay. Do you know the difference between a good fresh uh, I'm assuming and not. the one I'm looking at right now it looks a little loose. So you, well, I'm sure it's fun on a Friday night, but it's not the best mushroom. <laughs> you got it. So the way to tell a good fresh mushroom is turn it over, and if there's if you can see any of the stem, oh. if you can see the dark part, it's older. Here oh. it's completely covered. Yeah, it looks like all mushroom. That's a good fresh mushroom. I did not know that. So that's a good tip for you. This has been around wow. a little too long. Yeah, I know the okay. feeling. So you got okay. your you got your diced veggies. You've got your mushroom. You're going to cook this. And here is the big two big secrets. Um, when it's not an all day sauce, you don't have to cook pasta sauce all day long. You're going to bring it to a boil and simmer it. All of a sudden, about 20 minutes, 30 minutes later, you're going to see this dark oil, like okay. you struck oil. oil. This dark oil comes to the surface. Done. You're done. Oh, wow. When you see that dark oil, it huh. is done. The last thing I want to tell you, Beth, is never salt your pasta <gasps> sauce. Never salt it. Until the very end. Okay. When it's turned off and you're done, then you put the salt, because salt will make the tomatoes more acidic as okay. it cooks. And the more the tomatoes cook, they become acidic. So if you do that, we've got the recipe for you. If you do that, you will make the best sauce on the planet. This is a crowd pleaser. And I've served it today. I was very excited. I found this pasta. It's called Strozza Preti. And I yes. thought, well, this will be a neat story for Beth. It sounds kind of romantic. But it actually means choke the priest. I'm sorry oh, wow. about that. It, <laughs> sorry, Father Eric. So she didn't mean it. Please forgive her. Right, Father Eric, in the old days, uh, they the Italians were very upset at um, <laughs> priests who were, they loved the pasta sauce so much that they took it for themselves and they choked on it. So, <laughs> strozza preti is choke the priest. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Beth, I thought it was going to be a better Boy, story. You know, you find these things out along the way about us Catholics, and you think, you know, not everything was nice. So, <laughs> and I think they knew oh, that. <laughs> and also, Galileo, we're sorry what we said about you. <clears throat> Turn them into well, wine. It's oh, delicious. Good. Thank you, Jan. <clears throat> Your family so will love this. And the uh, recipe up on the blog at kez999.com. Just click on Beth and Friends. Beth and Friends and Food with Jan every Monday.